The first invasion of the Beatles did not happen in 1964. It actually happened over 400 years ago here at Jamestown. And like the invasion in 64, this too was a British invasion. The story begins with a 1610 well found in James Fort that I am currently standing on top of. But don't worry, it's been backfilled, otherwise you'd be hearing a splash right about now. Here we found over a quarter of a million artifacts dating to the early years of the fort. The beetles were discovered in this well. A tremendous amount of organic material survived below the water table. In the waterlogged layers, there was very little oxygen, which prohibited the growth of bacteria that would otherwise break down the organic artifacts. We started to see a lot of seeds while excavating down in these layers, and we decided to have a soil sample sent to an archaeobotanist who upon examining the soil noted numerous insect parts through a microscope. The soil was then sent to an archaeoentomologist, a scientist who studies insect remains from archaeological contexts. This sample contained many insect remains that were identifiable. Among these were nearly two dozen invasive European species. Amazingly, this is the earliest evidence of European invasive insects found on an archaeological site anywhere in North America. Insect remains can be invaluable to archaeologists trying to understand a site because they have huge potential to teach us about the surrounding environment, and in this case, these invasive European insects found in the well were no exception. For example, the remains of a beetle called the Trox scabber were found in the well. This is a synanthropic species that lives near humans and benefits from their activities. These are common near stables, or where there might have been feathers, or even animal furs. Another species, the sawtooth grain beetle, is common around spoiled grains in rubbish piles. Interestingly, in 1607, Captain John Smith remarks that insects had infested their store of grain. We also had species of beetles associated with the presence of barked wood on the site. Could that be firewood, or does it suggest that the fort's palisade posts may not have been stripped of their bark. There is another beetle I have not yet mentioned. I wanted to thank England for bed bugs. There were probable bed bugs found in this sample from the well. It is fascinating to think that a single beetle exoskeleton can end up adding volumes to the historic record. Many of these invasive European insects we now know we're at Jamestown, would have caused considerable depletion of human resources, which in turn would put stress not only on the colonists, but likely also the Virginia Indians. So in conclusion, the first invasion of the British Beatles took place over 400 years ago with stowaways arriving accidentally aboard ship, and not with the Fab Four arriving in 1964 by jet.